Well, since the release of water into the Rio Grande, it's been a great impact to our borderland residents, more so farmers out in Clint. KTSM News reporter Jasmine Perry has more details on the irrigation since the release of the water. Every year in March, irrigation begins and continues all the way through October 15. The Franklin Canal delivers water to thousands of acres of the upper and lower valley, and of course, the city of El Paso. We have four sluice gates, so right now uh, we've lowered those, and uh, we pressurize the system upstream, which allows uh, the water to move down to the farmer's ditch, and we've got another irrigation off a of lee lateral. So uh, this is the canal, and typically from canal we go to laterals, which is a smaller facility. Making its way to farmers' fields. The El Paso water transitions from uh, their pumps to surface water and starts uh, taking in surface water through the Riverside Canal and, and other canal plants uh, along the, our facilities to, to treat it and, and, and distribute to their system. However, this year it started a little late due to the drought. General Manager for the El Paso County Water Improvement District, Jay Ornelas, tells me because of the delay, they had to find alternatives to get farmers to water their crops a bit sooner. As the season progresses, uh, the snow from the winter starts to melt and we get the, the, the runoff begins. Uh, the Board of Directors on, on April 12th of uh, this year made an allocation for two and a half acre feet and uh, that's what we were going to start the season with and that's what we started with. Um, a full allocation uh, is four acre feet, so one acre of land has four feet of water to use throughout the season. And hopes to be in full allocation by July. We, the runoff has been uh, super this year, so we should be able to, to have some water in stores to, to, to run through the end of the, of the normal irrigation season. Giving farmers time to put in their orders with the El Paso Water Improvement District before mid-October. We've got approximately three, about 350 miles of canals, which is our delivery system, and about 300 miles or so of agricultural drains.